Hey wood burners, it's time for part two of this video. So in the first part, I burned this art piece. I took an old drawing of mine and decided to turn it into a new wood burned art piece. And in the second part, I'm gonna show you how I added ink. So uh, stick around and I'm gonna walk you through step by step how I add the ink from start to finish. So let's get started. I've got my finished wood burn piece. Uh, I've got my India ink and my brush and some water. The original art piece I created from the previous video has reds and oranges, but I'm gonna switch it up and go with some pinks and blues for this new one. I'm gonna start with the eyes by adding a little bit of water to this open space. Then I'm gonna dip my brush in the ink and then add a little bit of the ink into the watered area. Once I cover the area with pink, I'm gonna add blue just to the outer edge. The ink will naturally spread into the pink. Now I'm gonna add a top layer of water just to get the inks mixed a little bit. I'm gonna let it dry and then move on to the next step. Okay, now my eyes are nice and dry, so it's time to wet the surface with water. I'm gonna leave a small dry area in the center my goal is to add the ink to the outer edge and have it spread inward, leaving a small area in the middle that doesn't have ink. Now that the water is on the surface, I'm gonna start with the pink ink. I'm just using the water dropper from the bottle and adding it to the canvas edge. I'm gonna add another layer of water on top to help the ink spread more. Then I'm gonna add a little bit more ink and spread it. So my favorite thing about adding color this way is that there's no specific thing I'm trying to paint. I can just add some ink and water to the surface of the wood and they, they kind of mesh together to, to create really, really neat effects and I don't have to worry so much about having them come out perfectly. I like to use the brush a little to help spread the ink into all the spots on the edges. Sometimes it has a hard time finding its way into all the nooks and crannies, so I just take my brush and help it a little bit. Now it's time to add the blue ink into the pink. I like the way the darker colors spread into the lighter colors, so I like to add the lighter ones first and then kind of let the darker ones spread out into the lighter colors and kind of make cool patterns. I'm not gonna add as much of the blue as I did the pink or it will overwhelm it and dominate the pink and you'll kinda lose that color. Water's kinda pooling in this corner so I'm gonna lift the can canvas a little and shift the color around a little bit. Then I'm gonna let it sit and dry before I start adding ink to the edges. Okay, now it's time to add ink to the edges. This is optional of course, but because I add water to the surface of the wood and then let the ink spread it always kind of bleeds onto the sides so i like to add ink to the sides to kind of blend it all together adding ink to the edges is the same as the surface i'm going to add water first drop ink into the water spread it around with a brush and layer it with more water and ink to help it spread So I'm gonna have to let each side dry individually before I can move on to the next side. So I'm just gonna continue on adding water and ink to all four sides until they're done. Okay, so here's the finished piece. The colors will get a little dull when they dry, so I like to seal it with a poly spray that adds a little bit of a shine. I don't go full gloss, it's more of like a, a satin sheen that kind of lets those colors pop a little bit. Hey, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed my version of adding color to wood burn. Leave me some comments below about how you like to add color into your wood burns. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more wood burning tips and videos. Wood burners, so it's part, and I'm gonna walk you step by step. That's not right, walk you. I can't walk you anywhere.
Hey wood burners. Hey YouTubers. Nope. Hey wood burners. It's no matter how many times I do this, it doesn't get any easier. I 